we thought it would be just like way too much fun to bring some puppies together and uh, do a paint party to raise some funds for to help local animals in need. So tell me how the puppies are actually painting. How did you pull this off? So we brought the litter of puppies together and um, we put some canvases with some paint inside a little Ziploc baggie and then sealed the bag and we put a little bit of kibble, a smidge of little peanut butter just to kind of entice the pup. It was, it was just way too much fun. You know, all that activity created these beautiful, unique, uh, we like to call them masked fur pieces <laughs> that yeah. uh, we're now going to be able to auction and help raise some funds uh, to go towards our Sweat for Pets campaign. You can bid on the individual paintings. Are you still doing adoptions? Can people still see the dogs and adopt? Yeah, so we've um, moved to limited contact adoptions uh, for the time being, and it's actually going really, really well. The puppies that did the paintings, are they up for adoption? So that's very exciting. We expect them to be available as early as next week. So there's your little hint to, to just keep a really close eye out. The auction runs on their Facebook page from next Tuesday, the 25th of May until the 28th. For a link to see the paintings and adoption information, go to our website, citynews.ca slash extras. In Toronto, Audra Brown, City News.